Welcome to this short video demonstration on Snap Protect for VMware environments. This pictorial represents the Snap Protect for VMware environment. Snap Protect software is virtualization aware, providing automatic VM discovery to prevent accidental data loss. Snap Protect software uses integrated vStorage APIs, enabling file, image, or incremental level restores. Today we're going to demonstrate the backup and restore of a virtual machine, including a single file. This is SnapProtect version 10, and we are running a NetApp FAS system running clustered data on tap version 8. The first step is to add the virtualization client, the vCenter server, from the SnapProtect console. Now we'll create a new subclient. Here we add the virtual machine we'd like to see protected. Now we add the proxy server, the server on which VM resides, and find and add a storage policy. In this example, we will not select a schedule. Next, we execute the primary snapshot. We make it a full backup and select granular recovery. And here we see the progress of the backup. Now we'll create an auxiliary copy to perform the snap mirror operation. This copy will reside on a different storage controller. Now we'll perform a restore. First, we'll select the subclient and select Browse and Restore, then select the folder. It's here you can also select from where you restore, the primary or the snap copy in this case. Here we'll select a folder on the C drive for restore and we'll create a new folder to restore to and call it restore1 and go to the job controller to see the progress. Once completed, we navigate to the directory on our C drive and see the restored files. So to conclude, we've shown how to back up a full virtual machine and how to restore a file from that VM. To learn more about SnapProtect, please go to the URL you see here or see your local NetApp reseller.